Natalia moved to Lviv in 2014 after her homeland Crimea was occupied by Russia. Back in Simferopol, she used to work as a director in a theater. Now, in Lviv, together with local resident Denise Fedeshov, she's decided to create a new theater from scratch. I haven't been home for almost three years now. Unfortunately, that's impossible now. But I realize that there are lots of other people who are forced to become IDPs just like me. And still life goes on. The main goal of their theater is to unite all of Ukraine, the actors say. With their art, they want to destroy stereotypes, which are common for Ukrainian society. Now, they plan to go east, close to the front line. We want to unite our country because there are way too many attempts to divide it, either by language or by war. We are quite experienced already. Last year we went to Severodonetsk and Novo Aydar. We were delighted with how people there accepted us. There were no communication barriers at all. Citizens of Lviv support the amateur theater the best they can, by visiting their performances and by helping to collect money for the actors to visit Donbass. No words can express how much I enjoyed the show. I'm so impressed with the actor's play, I came here for the second time in a row. The director's work is quite impressive too, everything looks so professional. The theater enthusiasts are planning to go to eastern Ukraine with the Butterflies Are Free play by Leonard Gersha. The actors believe this piece will bring the spectators some warmth, love and desire to live.